Hey guys, it's makeup tutorial time again. Okay. Hey, hot miss Pam. Oh my god. Yes! Hey guys, thanks for stopping by my channel. Today we're going to be talking about eyebrows. It's one of the dreaded things I like to do when I am doing my makeup. That and eyeliner. Not a big fan. Not a big fan. I'm trying to find... I'm really into this Maybelline New York Brow Drama. I got the one in deep brown. This came out a while ago. It's the one with the ball on the edge. On, yeah. Um, for your eyebrows. I really like this one. I will definitely go back and get more. But I'm still using the tube. It works well, really, really well. Um, and then I got a thick chubby uh, brow pencil. Like, uh, like a chubby stick um, from the same line. And it was brow drama or whatever. That one wasn't really that good. Um, it the the um, stick part itself, um, the pencil part, it was just too thick. It wasn't going to give you the detail that you wanted, and so that was kind of a bust. But I really liked the um, the setting kind of wax that came in that tube that I just showed you. But today we're going to be talking. It's in the same line, Maybelline New York Brow Precise Fiber Volumizer. I got the color deep brown. And what's interesting about this, basically it's a, a product, a creamy product that you put on your lashes to set everything. But what it has is the, it has these fibers and you can kind of see the fibers that are hanging out. Now one side is basically just a flat piece of that um, plastic, but on the other side it's got these little grippy bits and it's oval shaped. Um, I tried putting this on just on its own. It works well, but we're just going to do my eyebrows. I mean, I can, I guess I can show you since we're doing video. So I just like this and then I use the edge of it actually to give me a little bit of shape because I don't have any eyebrows. And then I brush it in. Now take care not to brush too much. If you haven't waxed or cleaned up around it, it will grab, it will definitely grab those hairs. And then I'd had, I had to go back, um, and fix it up. But see how it just grabs all the hairs, it, um, all the fibers get in there and it makes my eyebrows, if you can tell the difference, it makes my eyebrows, um, thicker. And this is so good for, um, some of my lazy days uh, where I don't really want to do my eyebrows, but I need to have some definition because they're so light um, and uh, I don't have much there that I want something. And you can totally say, see the difference. I love this. I may rethink the brush, but um, as far as I'm concerned, it works pretty well. I mean, you just got to kind of get used to it and brush it in. like even right now. I mean, and this is the way that I, this is the way I do it when I'm in a rush and I just want to have something on my eyebrows and, um, it looks relatively natural and, um, but has some color. Now, the other thing that I'll do is I'll do my eyebrow and then, and then I'll brush this over. I'll show you how I do that. So I got my Wet and Wild, you can't tell what it is anymore because I've had it for so long, but it works so well. I love this stuff. Um, that will do my eyebrow really quick so you can see. And this is more of a polished eyebrow compared to the, this one. Because I get all the colors in there, shape it the way I like. So I just get a sh good shape on my eyebrows. Now, 
and that looks good. Um, but so you could tell the difference, obviously. But then I put this on, and what helps is like if you could see right here, it doesn't. That doesn't look natural. What you know? Let's be honest. I still rock it, but it doesn't. It doesn't look like real. So I go and see right here. You could see where I got a, some of it on some stray hairs. So you gotta be careful with that. But I just brush it through. Not only does it darken it, but then I go right here on the edge. And the comb thing on here is not that bad. But it gives me more of a natural kind of look right there on the edge, which I absolutely love. So you could see where it's just basic, natural, normal, um, you know, like quick out the door, but you want something. But then if you want really, really um, constructed and polished uh, eyebrows, you're going to get that too. I am, I'm, I love this. I might even like this more than um, the basic one. I mean, this works well, but I think this works even better for what I need it for. These are both good, but um, yes, yeah, so I would definitely do, um, recommend this to a friend. This would be nice for somebody that does have um, good eyebrows, but wants a little bit more oomph. This will definitely make them. You got to be careful. You don't want them bushy. Uh, but, you know, that natural eye look is going around right now, so that might be something you want to look into. Love it. Love it. Love it. I will definitely purchase this myself again. I'm a deep brown. I know they have a few other colors. I'm not really sure how many colors, but um, they definitely have some a handful of them. I got this for about nine bucks or something. Uh, not too crazy expensive. I think it's well worth it. Um, don't tell anybody, but I probably pay, pay up to 15 bucks for it because it's so good. Uh, but it's definitely worth it. Um, if you guys have anything that's similar to this, I'd be interested to know what it is. Um, but for right now, this is uh, the winner in my uh, in my book. Thanks for stopping by. I'm going to go and fix my eye, other eyebrow, and I will see you guys later. Bye, guys.